The ranking video app allows you to stream a tournament created in ranking.com live on the internet. This includes players' names and live scoring. Your friends can follow your match in real time together with the actual results shown in the result widget. To do this, you need to download the ranking video app from the Play Store. Just open the Play Store and search for ranking video. Download and install the application. Uh, the ranking video app will allow you to stream only events created and started within the system. It is very important that the tournament is started initially. The whole idea is that every person within uh, with the application installed can start the live coverage of the tournament. But of course, if the tournament administrator allows you to do this, if not, he can block it. So, if you want to have a live video from your tournament, the first thing that you need to do is to create it and start it in ranking.com. You can check how to create a tournament in one of my latest video tutorials. You can find a link within the description. Now, open the application. In the search bar, you can find the event you want to stream. Just tap on the event within the search results and you will be redirected to a page with all of the matches from the event. You can also choose to stream courts. Court view streaming will create one single broadcast in which the score widget will automatically switch between the next match planned for the given court. So, you can put your mobile phone for the whole day streaming from the court and the system will automatically show a scoreboard from the match which is currently in progress on this court. So, just to note, matches should be first scheduled in Rankton so the app will know which match is next on the court. The video app is connected with the e-referee system from Rankton as well. So, while referring the match, the result in the video is updating in real time. You can see how to use eReferee in one of my previous video tutorials. You can find a link from it within the description as well. Now, I will tap on the match I want to stream and choose YouTube. I must note this, in order to be able to record live matches using the Ranked in Video app, first I must enable live streaming within my YouTube account. I've shown this procedure in one of my previous videos on how to activate YouTube live streaming. You can find a link within the description uh, within this video as well. Here you can choose a thumbnail, title and the description for the video that you will stream. Just tap accept after this and broadcast in YouTube is creating. Now tap on the red record button and you are starting the stream. When you start a stream you can find the video in the event homepage in rankton.com. Let's go there and see how it looks. The whole process happens automatically. Open the event and the live video plus replay section. Here you can see all the videos streamed for the event by any user from Ranked in Video. Uh, the admin of the page can manage the streams from the live event manager. Just click on the event manager button and go to step 8, matches and click on the video button. In this page you can stop the stream and this means that the user which is streaming will be cut off from live scoreboards. You can also remove any stream. This means that it'll disappear uh, from the event page in Rankton.com and from this page as well. If you need any further help with Rankton, just go to our YouTube channel for more tutorial videos.